There is a concept of IO burst and CPU burst. IO burst is when there is a lot of IO processing, while CPU burst is when there is a lot of CPU processing. IO bound tasks are those where the bottleneck is due to frequent IO bursts. In other words, IO bound tasks are slowed down by input output operations. For example, reading from or writing to a disk, network communication, or accessing databases. These tasks spend a lot of time waiting for these operations to complete. On the other hand, CPU bound tasks are those where the bottleneck is due to frequent CPU bursts. In other words, CPU bound tasks are slowed down by CPU processing. These tasks require a lot of computations, such as complex calculations, data processing, or running simulations. There are methods to overcome these kind of slowdowns. For IO bound tasks, we can use asynchronous programming, which allows the program to perform other tasks while waiting for IO operations to complete, multi threading or multi processing, which handles IO tasks simultaneously, reducing idle time. For CPU, CPU bound tasks, we can use multi threading or multi processing, which distributes the computational load across the multiple CPU cores, enhancing the processing speed. Algorithm optimization to reduce the computational complexity.